Um, hey guys, it's Bobo over there, and I want to show you a quick Visual Basic tutorial on how to make an auto spammer or auto texter, whatever you want to call it. First, open up Visual Studios. You can get a free version. Um, the express version for free, or you can download the beta like I have it. Okay, um, you want to open new project, or you can go here, new project. Um, I'll just make one right here. Sorry about that, guys. <laughs> Whenever I run my my uh, screen rec recorder, uh, Windows Seven messes up. Anyways, um, choose your framework. If um, if you're a beginner, don't worry about this. Um, but if you want to share it, I would recommend choosing this. So let's just choose this. Okay. Uh, you want to choose Windows Forms application, and then want and then you want to press OK. Okay, now that you have that, you want to. Um, let's just wait for it to load. Okay, now that you have that, let's start out with design. Um, but you want to get, you want to get two buttons. One here, and another one right here. Okay, uh, name the first one start. You can... You can do that by going in the right hand corner after you selected it. Right here. Going right here. And then name this one. Stop. Okay. After you've done that, you would want to rearrange it the way you want. Um, yeah, that looks. Okay. After you've done that, you want to get a text box over here. And then you want to, then you want to move that around wherever you want. Doesn't really matter. And then make that. After you've made that, after you made the text box. You want to get a timer. Now, right here, timer under components. If you want to drag that right there. Okay. After you've done that, you want to double click start. And you want to write down this timer one dot. Timer one dot enabled equals true. As so, that's what you want to write under start. Okay. Then you want to go to stop. Write down the same thing except the opposite. At the end, you want to write down false. So timer one dot enabled equals false. After you've done that. You want to double click the timer. This is what you want to write. Um, here, let me paste it for you. On this is what you want to write. On error, zoom next, and then you want send keys dot send, and then parentheses text box one dot text, and then end the parentheses, and then you want to have on error, zoom next again. And then you want to have send keys dot send, and then you want to have enter.
okay. After you've done that, you probably want to name your thing. So select the form, and then you want to go back to the right hand corner, and then you want to put down whatever you want to name. I'll just name this auto spam. Okay. Uh, you probably want to write down your name. Rewarder. Okay. Um, after you've done that, you can, there's a lot of other stuff you can do. You can select this, and you can, you know, change the color. Uh, let's say you wanted it, I don't know, red. You could do that. Or you could do it blue or something. Doesn't really matter. Then you can change this. Import a picture or something. Um, and that's it. Now, also, if you want to change the icon, first you need an icon, an icon for a picture, do that ISO, and then you want to go back here to icon, and then you can select it, an icon. Okay. Um, that's about it. So now, for first time users in Microsoft Visual Studios, um, First, before you, this is how you would finish a project, but you don't want to do that right away. Well, you, well, this one's simple and it's easy, so you probably could build it right away. But you, what you first want to do after you make an application is you want to debug it or test it out. So you want to go to the green arrow and start debugging, and then you and then you can test out the application before you build it. And and then Microsoft Visual Studios debugs it and finds any errors that you have. Okay, so you want to put down example. Then you want to press start, and then it just writes example over and over again. Um, and that's about it. Um. I'll also be making more tutorials in Visual Basic, and um, this is this is an easy project, but some of them will be more difficult. Um, and that's about it. So see you guys.